Thank you. Dr Kennedy Graham. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Um, I did not have the privilege of serving on this uh, committee to review these two bills, but, and I'm uh, speaking on behalf of our co-leader, Materia Ture, on this matter when I say that um, the Green Party is uh, entirely prepared to support uh, both amendments. The um, Electoral Amendment Bill, which aims to rationalise and clarify the law and improve services to voters and assist with the smooth delivery of the elections. On the one hand, and the Broadcasting Amendment Bill, which uh, aims to increase flexibility in the use of funding allocations provided to political parties for the election programmes. Um, there have been some pretty interesting issues raised in the course of the drafting and submissions and uh, the committee deliberation and its report back. Um, I tend to agree with our colleagues from Labour, uh, Chris Hipkins, who tends to say that it really amounts to just a few small steps to improve the electoral law and bring it into as close as we can into the 21st century, uh, but that much remains to be done if we're really going to complete that job. Um, and I recall also the comment of the Honourable David Parker that the, the essence of liberal democracy is an honest, accurate and transparent electoral system. Um, and we can take uh, some satisfaction in the fact that New Zealand is pretty well endowed in this, but that we cannot afford to rest on our laurels and that we have, and it is wise for us to revise this every three years after the election and to see how we can improve it. Some pretty interesting suggestions raised in the course of the debate and the previous readings, um, whether the, uh, uh, the IRD system should be used by way of identification uh, to, for the purpose of voting, as happens in the Nordic countries. Um, the question of whether you, it, it's, it should be sufficient to simply enrol at the time of voting, uh, turning up at the voting booth, as Jacinda Ardern suggested. Um, the question of a children's civics education program uh, to get them familiar with the idea, the, the essence and the intrinsic merit and the processes of voting. Uh, the question of advance voting, the question of, of prisoners voting and the slight absurdity of the situation of the law at the moment, the question of improving, further improving um, access to voters with disabilities, making it easier to switch for Māori, to switch between the Māori role and the, and the general role, uh, issues pertaining to the display of campaign material, and having regard and, and trying to answer to the increasing use of social media, digital technology um, for younger people. And I do agree that the issue is not an intrinsic lack or uh, an apathy on the part of young people, but rather the fact that the, the mechanism by which they are invited to participate in politics and in, and in the electoral system uh, is changing, and we need to keep up with that. Um, on balance, the Green Party is in, entirely happy with where we are at the moment and full recognition that more needs to be done and we need to pick up where we left off uh, after the coming election. The Green Party will be supporting the, the Cognate Bill. Thank you. Dennis O'Rourke. Mr Speaker, first.